Hi. Good morning. How are you? All right. Uh, today I'm outside, and I'm drinking a C4 because I'm going to the gym right after, so to get ready as a pre-workout. It's such a beautiful day. Oh my god, I love it. So today I just wanted to do a little um, catch up from yesterday's video. Um, and just give you a little update on how I'm doing. Um, first, I really want to appreciate uh, you and to say thank you. Thank you so much for all your amazing, heartfelt comments and supporting comments. You guys are really amazing and it's really amazing to see <coughs> how we can be... Um, understanding each other and and like I was saying in the video an ear to listen can go a very long way and has definitely more power than sometimes we think it does and to feel like you guys were listening to me without judgment with only support it's quite something and um, I want to thank you for that and I want to say that today I'm feeling better um, the weather is gorgeous. Sorry, my hair is wacky wacky. <laughs> my hair is so wacky. Uh, it's curly. So my hair is curly usually and it just gets like that in the morning. Um, so, um, I wanted to say I'm feeling better a little bit today. And I wanted to add more details to the video on how I felt. And um, I think a big part of it was me really realizing <coughs> the importance of the present moment of being here in the now and how those moments if not felt and lived a hundred percent and if you're not really present or thinking about the past or the future or if you're thinking too much about um certain things that takes you away from the moment like worries or stress you're just not here and and you kind of let them go away without and i've done that so many times in my life so i think that's why the tears were coming it's um maybe a little bit of regrets but it's the real realize oh my god it's the realization that I took some moments for granted and that I did had beautiful moments that I wish I was even more there and more here and that I sometimes did not listen to people and was more consumed into my opinions or my opinions into something um, rather than just listen you know, my family members telling me what they think, how they view life, how they view things. You see what I mean? What I was trying to say is what a gift to be able to be present with a person that you love, a friend, family member, lovers, that literally tells you nothing more than I'm alive, I think this, I'm doing this life and I'm with you because I'm enjoying it and, and I chose to and how it's amazing to just see that in the present moment. You see what I mean? And I think the tears comes from, yes, a little bit of the fear of the time going so fast because I really see time going so fast and the more I get uh, further in age, the days are going so fast. That's there's a little bit of fear of that in those tears, I believe. There's a little bit of fear. There's that realization that now I want to live those moments so much deeper. And there was that realization that um, I spent most of the time with my parents. That's what I meant at the beginning. Uh, I spent the biggest chunk of the time that I will spend with my parents in my life in the way that my mom is 72, my, my dad is 75, 
So I realize today that the biggest chunk of our lives together is behind. I know I have still a lot of years in front of me in my life. Uh, I just wanted to say that the moment, uh, the, the time of my life with my parents in this planet is the biggest chunk is behind me, if that makes sense. And I know it was not very clear in the video. So some tears came also from that realization. And I was tired and you know, um, I think when this kind of moments happen, it's so many things. It's also wonderful to be able to release all these emotions, to release the tiredness, to release the pressure, to release the stress. Um, and I'm very much in a place in my life where I welcome all of this. And even the moments where I'm going to feel like yesterday, I want to embrace them too. And I want to not be scared anymore to share them with others and with the people that I love. And I don't want to be scared to feel vulnerable. I don't want to be scared anymore to just be myself, even if my worries don't make sense, if what I say don't make sense. I. I just see a lot of value in now communicating, just being, feeling, feeling sad, feeling happy. This is all the experience of this life and why, why I believe I'm here now. And uh, there's a part of me that thinks it's amazing. And that's the part of me that was still smiling yesterday. And there's a part of me that think it's also filled with emotions and fear and 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 um, I don't think you ever really get rid of fears or doubts or um, I think it always stays here I just believe that you learn with time to cope with them better and to just put them in a little box well organized you know that you can control more whether you have access to it or not in your life but I think it always stays here and um, yes <laughs> so this is how I feel today and I just wanted to bring a bit more clarity to the video yesterday and tell you that today I feel much better and that I'm excited for today that I just woke up that I'm drinking my little uh, energy drink to go work out my body at the gym <laughs> uh, to stay active to move because I love that that's that's something that I love doing is keep myself moving and being active and uh, feel alive so and I'm excited for the next video tomorrow um, I'll try to take you somewhere or I'll do just do a little update like this uh, we'll see but I want to thank you again for your support and love. It, I see the, I, I, I um, I see the value of it, and I appreciate it very much. And um, and yes, again, I think we have so much power in this world. We don't re realize it um, individually with words, with love, with people around us and on the moment. And I think that is beautiful. And, uh, and uh, yeah, and um, things can get really tough. And I think it's important to acknowledge that too. Um, well, it will be today a short little update and uh, I will see you tomorrow for another video. Um, I send you big kisses. I hope you have a beautiful, sunny, <coughs> shiny day if you're in California. Um, wherever you are, have a good night, uh, good afternoon, and take care of yourself. And I will talk to you very soon. Bye.